Hey everybody, the Bond guest back. Welcome to part two of Let's Play Devil May Cry. Alright, before we begin to mission four, full disclosure, I did find a way to get a hell of a lot of orbs just in mission four alone. In fact, you can do that within the first few seconds. So I kept myself pretty busy and I amassed a huge amount of orbs just doing this one thing. So the first thing we're going to get is that air hike. Which will give us a double jump. I already got air raid, so that'll be helpful. Vortex level 1. We'll get round trip to throw the sword like a boomerang. Stinger level 2 will be great. I don't know if I want to get Vortex level 2 just yet. I think I'll use the rest of this just to... Uh, get some more health for 1. And get a purple orb. And maybe I should get some holy water or an untouchable. I think I'm going to save the rest of my orbs. So yeah, we got ourselves a little overpowered pretty early. And I'm going to show you what I've been doing just to get this point. Oh yeah, that stat's going to look a lot better. When you're going down this hall, Phantom attacks you again. So watch what I do. That's literally all you do. Just keep helm breaking over and over. And then once you kill him, you get 500 orbs. Just like that. Alright, so let's go over our moves. Eric is just double jump. That's fine. Hold down the triangle button. The longer the hold, the longer the distance. We already know what Stinger does. Vortex just allows you to damage enemies with an intense spinning body attack. While airborne in the double trigger state, use the left stick and the triangle button. Air raid is just press R1 while jumping in double trigger state. Then press circle or square to strike electrocution. That sounds pretty dandy. Alright, I guess I can go in here. Hello. Oh, I remember this. This was a biplane room, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Now we should be cooking with gas. Oh, damn, you just got me with both blades right in the back. How dare you? That's what you get. That's what you get for exposing me like an absolute fool. And the thing is, some of you puppets already look like fools. Oh, it's already on brand for you all, for you schmucks. Get out of here. Hmm, I don't see any reason to go there yet. Like, why would I go back in a combat room? What the hell? Oh, it's... Hello. Bye. <laughs> hmm. I guess I could buy something else. Do I want to get another uh, purple orb? Nah, I think I'd rather more health. She's just gonna keep chasing me, isn't she? Yeah, I think that's what's gonna happen. Could have gone that way and skipped the whole phantom fight altogether. But let me see what's over this way. Secret mission, Phantom Baby. Defeat 100 Phantom Babies within the time limit. I have 30 seconds to do this. 
Okay. I was clearly looking one way. Why would I swing the opposite end? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna succeed on this. Ah, I failed. Alright, let me leave him re-enter. So here's what I'm thinking. I might have a... Oh, now I'm outside. Uh, I don't want to be outside. Let's switch to the Ebony and Ivory. I think I would do better with handguns. Didn't mean to share a screenshot. I want to try that again. Okay, that goes a little bit better. Still may not make it, holy crap. The only thing good about this is that you can get a fair amount of orbs doing this, too. Well, failed again. Okay, so I came from that door, so I wonder if I can just go in this one. Do have the pry of the line, and I think I gotta use it here. There's an immense power that will not allow anyone to get closer. Before I can confront the line, I'll need a sign. Shall I use the pride of line? Yes. Here sleeps the gatekeeper. Magical destruction will awaken him. I did it. Destructive enough? Whoa! Trying to attack me right away, huh? Oh! I see how it is. I cannot attack him with melee. Let's switch back to the shotgun. Yeah, because every time I hit him, I get hurt. I guess I could use Air Raid, too. Hmm. Oh, now I can actually hit him. So yeah, you have to wait for the core to be exposed. And then it blows up. That's how you eliminate those shadows. Oh, oh, might as well get all this stuff. Yeah, like I said, I never committed to getting, like, all the blue orbs anyway. Like, I'll try, because it'll keep me alive, but, you know. If I don't get them, I don't get them. I'm just doing this for fun. Hello! Get wrecked. Hmm, I have a nice reflection. It's a statue of a female with a melancholic expression. There's an opening to place something. An emblem of a sun is engraved, there's something written beneath it. The brightness of the guiding light will scorch you. Only those who can bear the light can open the new path. There are documents here that were probably used for diplomacy. With the neighboring countries. I wonder what the neighboring countries even were. Like Malay Island, would that be like France? I should get the blue orb. There we go. It's sealed shut by immense power. 
It's an amazingly beautiful mirror, but still, there's something dark and evil deeper than its reflection. As if it's trying to suck me inside. And I can't break it. I can't even take that orb! Feel proud of yourself for showing up? Get wrecked. Again. I guess I have to climb higher in this tower. There's something written. The sword is the key to freeing the soul. The key resides at the highest place. The highest place? Isn't this the highest place? I don't think I need to drop down there. Hmm. Yeah, I thought you had just had to hit that. What about this door? Nope, you don't use a the sword there. You guys must be tired of showing up constantly, aren't you, huh? Alright, let me just go back down the tower. I think there might have been something I missed up ahead. Because I think I did need to come from here. I mean, I had to get here eventually. Oh shit. Oh god, they have sides! Yeah, the shotgun is just amazing against them. Oh, another one. Yeah, I just gotta get up close and just blast away. Point blank, baby. That's how it's done. There must have been something that I needed. Like, I had to go in here. Was there anything in this room? Maybe in here? No, I was in here. Shit. Said the sword was the key. What if I just backtrack? No, 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 not in the library, not in the library. Pretty sure that wasn't it. I do have to go in here. I'm pretty sure I do. And these sisters are still here. Wait, I do remember seeing something at the end of this room. Jackasses. That's what you get. There's something engraved beneath the opening. This is where the guiding souls gather. Oh, I didn't know I was still in Devil Trigger or something. Hmm. Nope, that's not it. Do I have to drop down the tower? 
Damn, what if I had to go in that lion door, but go down? Yeah, let's just drop down here. Whee! Yeah, there was a room right here! Oh my god. This might do something for me. Yeah, see? It's gonna get me to the highest point. And there's the sword. Dead Sentence. A decorative sword used for rituals. It cannot be used as a weapon. I'm gonna head back down and see what's in this door. It's sealed shut by immense power. There's something written. This path will open with a guiding soul. Hmm. I still need one of those. Well, at least I got the sword that I need. I just gotta find where it's gotta go. Ah, gotta do this again, don't I? See, that's... That multi-stab combo can just open those in one shot. That's pretty cool. I gotta read this one last time. So I probably can fish the soul out using the sword. Go away. I got no time for you. There's an opening to play something. Shall I use the dead sentence? Yes. Melancholy soul. An ornament resembling a soul. When activated, it loses its power over time. But I'm not gonna leave the door open for you. All right, you want to throw down? I'll throw down. Some cool looking armor. Hello. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. He got me with all the hits. Okay, I can actually break his block this way. Oh. Oh, I think I am staggered. I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, he tried to go for a cheap shot. That ass. Oh, I shouldn't have dodged that way. Oh, he actually interrupted my helm splitter. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Oh, now where is he up to? All the way up there. All right, he's almost down, but unfortunately, so am I. Oh yeah, I just used the Vortex move. Almost got him. Got him! First try. I should use that necklace more often. You're no angel. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? B. Okay, I'm satisfied with that ranking. All right, let's save it up. Yeah, I saved an obscene amount of times. I'll admit it. <laughs> Go to the destination before the power of the melancholy soul fades away. Okay, but I just gotta go through that door. I know where that is. Alright, can I buy any more power-ups at this point? I'll buy some holy water. I might need that for something. Oh, that's right. I still have the melancholy soul. So I had to get through there in three minutes. Wait, why are you showing up now? I think I just gotta go back the way I came. Is it this door? Oh shit, I see something. Oh, I, I won't be able to get to it right now. Sorry, I just have to worry about that later. It's gone. Oh yeah, and I remember where the door was. I think. This is the way the camera can get. I might just lose my sense of orientation. And now it's just making me look like a fool. Yeah, I don't want to get that too. No, I can't. Oh, hello. Ah. Oh. See, I would have gotten that, I would have just started the mission over. Oh, there it is. Also, I just noticed you can't use the wall jump when you actually do that. Oh my god, this is making me look dumb. I may not have enough time left. Just down this hole. Oh my god. Oh, I have to defeat the enemy to open the door? Okay, I, I got an idea. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna reset. Because I already saved before the mission, anyway. Okay, so I know where the door is. I actually do have to kill the enemy. 
I mean, I should have known when I saw that the barrier. I guess Air Raid would also help. Maybe don't do that. Ah, I did it again. Oh my god, it's just slamming me. Now it's getting me with every grab. Where'd I go? I actually got stuck for a brief moment. Would I actually do better with the uh, handgun? So I shoot faster. Okay, I think that's it. Oh my god. It got me with a super grip and it blew me up. Damn! Well, that mission was just kicking me in. Great. Got under a minute to go now, because that guy was just wasting my time. Speaking of wasting time, let's see if I can get over there again. Fuck! You know what, I'm not gonna get that blue orb, screw it. Like, I'm sure you gotta get up on that tower and probably air raid your way across. But with so little time, I don't think I can just bother with it anymore. I'm sorry, that's it. Whee! Yes, use it. And that was the mission! <laughs> that's really all that was. gone a lot better, but what can you do? Next mission, please. Evil of the Waterways. Defeat the Evil Guardian and acquire the Guiding Light. Now it looks like I'm in some kind of sewer system. Oh! A blue ore fragment just showed up right there! I thought that was a way to get somewhere. It's not. Okay, so I do have a full barb, and I was just building up a second one. I can see that little nub on the top. Alright, just pick a door, I guess. Mm, nothing, nothing. Something over here. A key. Oh god! Oh, this is like that Dark Souls 3 DLC. They're seeing a bunch of giant flies. What? What? Ow! Good lord, they just spitting everywhere!
There, that's what you get. Jerks. Spreading her maggots all over me. I don't like that. It's gross. Oh god, there's more of them! I just gotta find where their door is. Hmm. What the hell? Oh, is this like some kind of fountain I can just use to get a lot of... Get a lot of red orbs? That's actually pretty cool. I'm glad I was able to take advantage of that. Huh. I think it just keeps following you the whole time. Oh, I just got turned around. Go away. Man. You really should have got, like, all this sorted out. Just get all the, those flies out of there. You know, get, like, a healthy uh, septic system going on in this castle. This must be the door I need the key for. Yep. Who's waiting for me now out of more flies? Hmm. Seems a bit excessive to put some green orbs right there, but I'll take them. They were giving me red ones too. Who might have turned down the red ones? What the hell? Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Let me get my shotgun ready. Oh, it's just no selling that. Okay, at least I can get him like that when he holds it like that. Oh. Damn it. I was dodging inconsistently the wrong time. Are you kidding me? You're just gonna spam that? Okay, I actually broke the mask. Oh my god. It'll just always lock on to you. How do you dodge that successfully? And it still got to put the clamp on me. Still. Oh great, now he's on fire. There. Okay, let's learn about this enemy before I have to fight it again. Death Scissors. Okay, stats made from bones of animals and humans create an evil barrier. This barrier is impenetrable. Beat the enemy within it. Their screw attacks are accurate and very destructive. Dodge to escape these attacks. Yeah, yeah if you can find the right time to dodge them. I want us to try to fight these evil spirits from surface, become a devil hunter, and take the fight into air. Okay, so they're recommending air raid. Or just, you know, fire your gun in the air. Head of the main body is their weak point, but regular guns won't have much effect against it. Weakest points are their horns. Find a way to attack their horns, the most effective way to fight them. So I guess Helmbreaker. Caves are nothing more than illusions created by evil spirits. All physical attacks are useless. More powerful than the sins, most likely counter Dante's attacks by deflecting. When they concentrate evil on their heads, their heads turn red and all their attacks become ineffect- All your attacks are ineffective. Do your best to dodge the attacks when they glow red. Okay. Had to use a vital star for that. The fight was just kicking my ass. There is the guiding light. Just nothing more than a key.
Well, I'm gonna get penalized for using that item. Yep. Down to C. Just might barely make it to B if I manage to avoid using that star. Holding the key to Ardor. Uh, how much do I need for Vortex level 2? 2400? I might save up on that. Should get another Vital Star. I don't think it'll go up any more in price, will it? I hope not. Maybe the Holy Water could have worked too. But I'm still holding on to it. Return to the bedroom before the Guiding Light absorbs all of your vitality? Oh! Well, it's a good thing I have, like, over one health bar. Because this could suck without it. And they have these rooms there to recover your health. If you need to. Oh, for God's sake, you again! Fine, I'll just have to get rid of you too! Kiss me the fuck off! Well, at least he went down in seconds! Seconds might be all I have if I take too long. Are you kidding me? That one combo took like half my entire health bar. Oh right, this is the way I need to go, shit. Ah, these sides just mess you up! This keeps up, I might have to use a yellow orb! Oh, thank god these guys dropped the green ones too. That'll buy me some time. Beat me up! Please! Let's see how you deal with a man that's in a hurry! Oh, thank god I actually did not have to kill those flies! An emblem of a sun is gray, there's something written beneath it. The brightness of the guiding light will scorch you. Only those who can bear the light can open the new path. Right here. Ooh, it's a safe. <laughs> okay, I just won! <laughs> like, a lot of these missions you can just finish really fast. Oh, I got an A. Good stuff. Real good stuff. Alright. Eh, we'll do one more mission and maybe I'll call it an... Uh, oh wait, this is not an actual mission. It just seems like an intermezzo or something. Oh, here we go. The Legendary Knight Returns. Activate the mechanism and escape from the rooftop. I should get another purple orb so I can get another rune for double trigger. What a comfortable place, isn't it? So I wonder how the hell I activate this mechanism. I gotta go to that door over there.
Do I have to really face that Black Knight again? Yeah, I would say so. I mean, who else would be considered the Legendary Knight? <laughs> at this point in time. Whoa! You gotta be kidding me. I gotta deal with you again? Good, neither am I. I was getting tired of playing your childish game. Oh, I hit that too early. I find that sometimes, like, when it comes to the fireballs, like, they can come out super fast or they come out super slow. And that time he just missed. And that time he came out way too fast. Oh man, I actually had my finger on triangle and it was too late. Ugh. I was just prevented from jumping at the time. When it comes to like the flame pillars, that seems to be a good time as any to actually attack. Because after the six of them pop out, you're ready to hit them. Thought he just shot another projectile in the air. Got him! Although he barely killed me, too. Squash like a bug. What did you expect? I wrecked your motorcycle. I could go over there, but what's up this way? Thought there'd be something else up here, but I guess I can't reach it. Ah, here we go. Trident! A heavily decorated three-pronged pike that's used for rituals that cannot be used as a weapon. Hmm, I gotta go find out where it's gotta go. It's a magnificent sculpture. There's nothing particularly strange about it. It doesn't have to be strange, it just has to be magnificent. Can I get on that poor sculpture? Oh! No, get back on it. Get back on the saddle. Oh, I didn't mean to drop down there. Okay, I can get back up. I want to get that. What? 
Oh. Let me give it another try. This seems like an easy one to get. It's the way that lip is out. There we go. I can at least try for that one. It's right there. Dante go down the hole. <laughs> what the hell is this? It's a lever used to wind up the drawbridge. It's heavily rusted. A strong downward force may move the lever. Like that? <laughs> it will lead us out of the castle. Hold on, what the hell did that open? Can I get over to that that corpse? It's a corpse of a soldier who must have wandered into the castle and died from exhaustion. He's holding something. A grenade gun! Oh ho ho ho! Now we are playing with true power. There are three openings to insert something. Oh, perfect for the trident. That looks like our way out. Huh, I thought you were gonna try to keep me trapped in here, huh? Drop some green orbs for me. And then maybe I'll be nice enough to showcase the grenade gun. There's no such thing as friendly fire. So yeah, it's good for like destructive damage. Not so good for combos. So let's get that right. If you're gonna use the grenade gun, don't think you're gonna get any combo out of it. Oh, that's much better. The lattice gate should be in this door, right? Yes! But it's not open. I feel like I'm missing something crucial here. Hmm. Still won't open. No, I use the trident. But then what? I don't think the grenade gun is needed. I came from there. Use the trident again? You know what I did? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. That was for the gate, but I was too slow. I see how it is. I just had to ignore everything. Yeah, he's, you can hear the noise. Oh, I just made it on the other side. Sploosh. 
Hold on. Is there anything in these pools of water? I feel like there should be something. Aha! Wait, I checked there. And there we go, another mission cleared. Ah, oh, that's probably gonna give me C. Yeah. Because I lollygag too long. Alright, we'll save it up. I feel like we're getting pretty uh, deep into the first half of the game now already. I mean, the first episode was a small bit of progress, and now all of a sudden, we go from Mission 4 to Mission 9. Yeah, we just, uh, kicked up the pace, don't you think? I'd say my next purchase should be Vortex Level 2. Because I can do pretty well, all things considered. Um, I think we'll just stop here, and then the next episode we'll do... What was the name of Mission 9 again? New strength. Use the new strength to open the door. I wonder what we are going to get. See you everyone. Thanks for watching.